A very long time ago, and I'm talking decades, I went into an electrical distributor to pick up some materials. And they had these little dinky light meters on offer at the time. And I thought, you know, that would be quite useful. It's, I'm not sure how accurate it is. It measures in multiples of 100 lux. So technically speaking, it goes up to 3,000 lux, I'm guessing then. And uh, as soon as I got home, I opened it, as one does. And the circuitry inside is breathtakingly simple. It's Basically, it's a moving coil meter. And these things are super sensitive. They're usually rated for full-scale deflection. You'll find them rated things like 100 microamp FSD. That means 100 microamps will give full-scale deflection when, you know, you pass current through from one side of the coil to the other. The other thing it's got across here is a 10k potentiometer and a solar panel. I'm not sure what voltage this solar panel is. Can I see how many sections it's got in here? No. I'll tell you what, let's uh, measure that. So it's a silicon solar panel I can see under there. Uh, let's turn it around to about 2 volts. And we're expecting roughly, if I hold this up to the light, we're expecting roughly about um, half a volt, roughly, per, uh, per section of the cell. So let's uh, try and get the meter on here. So that is just a single cell. Okay. In that case, let's uh, doodle the schematic out. Not just going to take that long. Notepad. So let's start with the solar cell. There's plus, minus, and a couple of arrows to indicate light shining on it. Um, we'll go across to the negative of that goes straight to the negative of the meter. And I'll draw the meter just as a circle with microamps in it. Negative, positive. Um, the positive of the meter goes to the potentiometer which is connected between uh, the positive and the negative of the of the meter and then the positive from the uh, solar panel comes across and just goes across so you can actually then fine tune it you can calibrate it you can adjust that uh, resistance As, I don't know whether this is acting just as a load on the solar panel it may well be doing that an adjustable load or just acting purely as a potential divider and uh, basically running this in a sort of voltage type of skill but um, it's very simple very very simple I guess that's all that's needed. So um, it's that thing, you, though you don't know how accurate this is. It's, I think if you put five different light meters next to each other, even high-profile ones, they'd all give slightly different readings. But I suppose this one is ideal just for basic measurements. But uh, yeah, nice simple schematic. Very, very simple indeed.